arise out of the sleep that you've got yourself into. Uh, the devil has come and he's rocked you to sleep, but it's time to wake on. Wake up, wake up. Uh, but you know what? He's going to come one day and he's going to say, just sleep on now. Just sleep on. As they come today to get a song ready, he's going to say, just sleep on. You know what? The hour has come. The hour has come. And he's going to come and he's going to just receive those that are ready. You know what he said? He's only coming for those that are looking for him. The rapture is just going to be for those that are looking for him. Everybody that, uh, whenever he comes in, the rapture is not going to see him. You know why? Because he's only coming for those that's looking for him. The dead in Christ shall rise up first. Those that are alive and remain shall be caught up to ever be with the Lord. We'll be changed in a moment in the twinkling of an eye. I don't know about you, but I'm looking forward to the day whenever he steps out on the clouds of glory and says, come up higher. I'm looking for that day whenever he says, enter in to the joys of the Lord. I want to be ready. And I pray that if I'm asleep or if I'm slumbering, that God wakes me up. I want to be woke up out of the sleep that the devil has tried to walk, rock me to sleep in. I want to be ready to go when he comes. Praise the Lord. We've got some prayer requests here we want to pray over. That there's a man in the hospital, uh, uh, Thompson. He's sick and he needs a healing. Uh, Lorraine Hammonds uh, is in tune and she's in, uh, in tuned in and she has then joined the program. The Mills family that needs prayer. The Ber Berkman family needs prayer. Praise the Lord. Sister uh, Cindy Rain, she needs prayer, praise God. So we want to hold them up to the Lord, and we want to pray. Uh, he said, the prayer of faith shall save the sick, and the Lord shall raise them up. And if they've committed any sins, then they'll be forgiven. So praise the Lord. We want to lift these prayer requests up to the Lord, and we know that God will meet the need. I don't care what it is. All you've got to do, and you may not have called in, but you've got to need. God's got the answer. All you've got to do is believe. He said, for two agree is touching anything whatsoever they ask, believe it and it shall be. That's a promise from your heavenly Father and he will answer. Father, right now, Lord, you see these needs, God, in these requests. Lord, we lift them up to you. We know, Father, that you are a healer. Because you said in your word that by your stripes we're healed. Right now, Lord, we're going to stand on your word. You said your word would not return void, but it will accomplish. And I thank you, Father, that your word goes forth and it brings forth healing in each and every one of these lives. Lord, for everyone that is out there, if there's one that is lost and undone that don't know you, God, let this be a time that the convicting spirit of God would begin to convict and draw them to the place, Lord, that they would surrender their will in line with your will. Your will, your will is that all men will be saved and come to the knowledge of the truth. In Jesus' name, and amen. Pass me not.